Yo, what's up, guys? Today we're gonna be getting CDK. We're gonna be getting a little help from Rella over here, and we're gonna be doing it. We got the other soil, so we're gonna skip to where we about to hit it. Okay, guys, we are now level 380, 348. I'm tripping, my bad. So Rella over here helping me out, and let's go 350 on the dot, baby. Uh huh. Okay, guys, we are now at the NPC. I'm gonna explain to you. To get CDK, you need 350 mastery on Yama and Tushita. After you get that, you'll be able to talk to the NPC like I was just doing. And you're going to go over here and the door going to open. You have to get six of these little fractal things and, you know, do all that. I can't believe you thought it was going to be that easy. It's not. To get each little fractal, you need to do three challenges. There's six. There's three for Yamada and three for Tushita. The first one we're doing here is pain and suffering. Pain and suffering is pretty easy. All you gotta do is die by NPC while holding Yama. So let's go do that right quick. It really doesn't matter what NPC you let kill you. You can either let it kill you or do like around 8,000 plus damage. But I would say just let it kill you. As you see right here, I'm getting clapped up by fish and boom, here goes the fragment. That's really pain because I just lost bounty too. Let's go on to the next little puzzle that we got to do that one a little more difficult and really really annoying i got y'all okay so basically the next trial or the second trial is called haze of mist i think i said that right basically in this trial you literally gotta go around and kill every npc with this purple marking and they spawn in literally anywhere like it could be anywhere they spawn in around the entire third c no matter where they at and it's so annoying i recommend you having portal because if you don't have portal oh my god it's going to be a pain bro you're going to have to actually run around and go to every single seat so i'm gonna show y'all me doing this we're gonna skip to where i you know uh kill the last npc with the purple markings so let's go do that right quick okay guys so after running around for 20 minutes straight I was in like the sea of treats fighting these dudes and I finally killed the last NPC and they gave me the second fragment I think it's the second one yeah I'm pretty sure they gave me the second fragment I was so hyped up I was going crazy I was like dancing in my room for real you got to move on to the third trial and the last trial for Yama which is that kind of the most hardest let's go Okay guys, so the last trial for Yama is Fear the Reaper. Basically, you need to die by the Soul Reaper. So, during this whole gameplay, I've been saving up bones. I got like 1,400 1, bones. I've been saving up bones just for this. So, let's roll and see what we get. Okay guys, so we're now about to roll. As you see, I have 1,446 bones and 10 spins. I've been waiting for this moment. Okay, first spin, money. That's all right. That's what we most most people get, money. I don't. Well, I do need money, but you know what I mean. Yo, move on to the second spin. Come on, second spin. Let's see what we get. The second spin, we got more money. Come on, bro. Third spin. Let's see what we get, guys. Third spin, we get. It better not be money again. Fragment. So wow, thank you so much. Okay, come on. Next spin. Fragments again. I got all these fragments from Fox Fox Shrine Hunting. I don't need more. Wow, 10 minutes of XP even though I'm max level. Thank you. Come on. We got five left. Oh my god. Let's go. Come on. Just give it to me. Money again. You can't make this up, bro. I got the worst luck ever. Four. Come on. Money again. Is it that hard to get fire essence? Come on. Come on, bro. Oh my god, bro. Two left, bro. One more. Then we done. Give it to me. Give it to me. And I got fragments. I hate this game. Well, we are done for. But I couldn't give up. My mom did not raise a quitter, and I rolled devil's luck. If, 
And if you don't believe me, I'm about to pop a pitch up right now. Look at that. Guys, Cherlick and Hollow Essence. Devil's Luck title. So after getting Devil's Luck, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to take the risk. I don't know if I was going to lose my God's Cherlick, but I was like, F it. Boom, spawned the Soul Reaper. I was ready to get clapped up by him in 3.2 seconds, and I didn't care how he did it in any way or style. So I'm jumping up the, I'm like, bro, am I going to lose my God's thing? I wasn't tripping too much because I didn't have no use for it. You know, I got every single thing, but, you know, I could get fruits from that stuff. You see me walking all intimidatingly. Look at me. Mm, he come running to me, clapping me up, bro. Look at this. He not playing. He really want it. That sounds gay. Okay, I need to stop. That's a little sus. Boom, it spawns me to the opposite of heaven dimension. After spawning me, there are near light torches. So I'm looking around, I see my first torch, and boo cool skeleton spawn, bro. Just jump at me. I'm like, what is happening? I beat these skeletons, go to the next torch, and the same thing happens. Boo cool skeleton spawn. I was so annoyed, bro. Like, I turned Buddha on this time, though. I was ready to clap him up, destroy him. But the third time was different. I couldn't move, and he had a ginormous, double-cheeked up, thick Godzilla on me. I was like, what is happening? How am I supposed to kill that? So I killed all the minions and then killed him with my permanent Buddha with Yama. Boom, and destroyed him. I went through the portal, and after that, I got the third fragment and finished the Yama scroll. I was hyped up. I was happy. I was screaming out of the top of my lungs, bro. The top of my lungs? I didn't even know how to feel no more. I was going crazy, basically. Not gonna lie. But we are not done yet. We still have to finish the other three, which is the Tushida, which is a little bit more harder. So, let's go to... So after doing all of the Yama, the evil sword, we will now be doing Tushida. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Which is the heavenly sword, I guess. The first trial was called Doc Legend, which basically all you gotta do is go to different, like, you know, boat dealers and go all the way to the last thing and go see a part of me. You just do that to three different ones, which is not that hard. It's pretty easy. I really hope you got Portal. Portal helps a lot with this. You know, he'll be doing it again with the second one. And on to the last one, which I finally get the fragment that I need. Boom. Press pardon me and boom, there you go. I obtained the fragment. Now the second one, I actually lost the footage, but all you have to really do is wait for a pirate raid to start and kill one of the raid, like the little pirates. Then after the raid was finished, you would get it. You it don't it didn't matter if you died or not. But let's just skip this one. So boom, on to the final one. It took me a very long time to do, which is soulless. This one is very strategic. You need to kill K Queen, but not just that. Before, uh, like a like a specific music, like starts, and every single time I joined the server, I could not find K Queen. So, my friend helped me. He basically joined the uh, abandoned server and let me join him. And I thought it was gonna work, but then I was like, okay, whatever, let's just check. Boom, he she was there. So when I mean I ran up there so fast, and they remembered I had to go accept the little thing right quick. I ran over there, accept the thing. Teleported back and boom, I whooped her. I whooped her in, in flash type speed, supersonic flash 3000 type speed. I was killing her after I, ki I killed her, it teleported me to heaven basically, which is basically the opposite of you know what. And I had to light the torches like I did in you know what. So after lighting all these torches, I was ready for the last one. That's what y'all already know what happened. Epic theme me music right here. <laughs> I'ma let y'all listen to it. Boom. We light the last torch. I glitch out a little bit and then the big boss boy, the super thick boy pop out. I'm whooping him. Whooping him. Super sonic speed 3000. He's a light user. Obviously, this is heaven. But boom, we whooping him, right? Destroying them all. After we finally finish whooping the last final skeleton, we could go. So we walk through the gates of heaven and we got the final fragment which means we completed all trials and got every single thing i want to go check and boom as you see right there six fragments i was super happy i was excited i was going crazy 
But for this one, we still got one more thing we do. We got to kill the boss to get CDK. There's a 100% chance drop rate. All you got to do is either kill him with Yama or Toshia. But you got to have that enabled. You see me? I'm walking on there. Got my big boy pants on going crazy right now. Doing my little walkie walk to the thing. Boom. So I make it there. Skeletons on the wall. I'm thinking about how hard I tried. And I'm on live doing this, by the way. If y'all want to check out the live, it's on my YouTube. Literally, I got CDK. That's literally the name of the live. Boom. We tap it. The six shards of legendary. I don't know what that means. React to each other forming a gym. Boom. The gym enters the door, and the door opens up finally. I never thought I was going to be this far. We walk into the room, and he spawns. So I go crazy. I'm like, okay, come on. Get my head. He might be a hard boss. Bro, I destroyed that boss. I destroyed that boss in like 10 seconds. He couldn't even move. He couldn't even think how bad I was destroying him. And it was the easiest thing ever, too, because he wasn't even that strong. Look at me. Look at me. Messing over this dude. He didn't even know what to do. After I killed him, I got the mythical CDK sword. And I was going crazy. It just it was such a cool way it happened. All these little skeletons started following me. But basically, that's how I got CDK. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, and you know.